was it like just waiting your turn? I mean, you've had turns and spurts, but not as like a full time guy. What's it like biding your time to at least have a chance to be as a full time guy? Um, I mean, I'm just you know just here trying to you know make as many plays as I can. It's, it's nothing about like waiting or when you you know you just got to take advantage of the chances you get. You can't worry about the next time. You just got to be ready every time you run out there. One of the things Coach Kelly mentioned in the spring that your ball skills, just being able to catch the ball from the air, and improved so much. You had a couple of catches today, one kind of turned around. And all. what have you felt that needed the most improvement there that you feel that you've been able to upgrade? Um, just looking the ball in, you know, the whole way um, into your hands. You know, sometimes I would, you know, try to catch and then at the same time I'm trying to catch, I'm looking this way or looking the other way. So it's just um, more focusing on what you got to do in your route and then focus onto the ball. What do you feel you need to make the most improvement to be that continued front runner at that position? Um, I mean, I can, I can go on all day about that. You know, it's just, it's just everything, you know, just being consistent with, um, you know, my play and, um, you know, doing what the coaches want. So. George, how much more comfortable are you now than maybe last year and certainly two years ago? Um, definitely more comfortable um, just because I, I know what the coaches are expecting, um, like different plays and um, in, in this offense. So I'm just more comfortable with the play calling and everything else. I'm, I just know what to, what to expect. You know, so. it, is it weird going from a guy trying to make plays last year and, and contribute to, hey, you're the veteran now? Um, yeah, it's a little weird, you know, you, you knowing that your time is, you know, it's coming to an end here at this great university. But um, yeah, it just means I gotta take advantage of every chance I get, you know, to uh, represent this, um, this football team in the school. So, uh, how much, how eager are you to, to to be able to claim this spot and and kind of be that go-to guy back there? How much would you love to have that role? Um, you know, I'm not I'm not worried about the future right now. I mean, I can I can, you know, I can't wait to you know. Uh, break long ones and do all this, but I'm just worried about you know going through camp right now. And um, tomorrow we got two days, so that's what I'm worried about right now. So you're known as that home run guy who can break that 50, 60 yard on any given play. What's been it has been more important to you to establish yourself as maybe that three, four, getting that tough three, four, five yards in between. Time. Yeah, definitely. You know, and um, just realizing that every play is not going to be a 50 yard run. Is, is a big step for me, you know, because last year I was more focused on trying to make that big play and trying to break it outside every time, I, every chance I get to, you know, outrun the defense. But now I realize it's about getting those vertical runs and getting those tough yards, you know, through the defense. So.